Hello everyone, myself Christy Vergis. I'm the author of the book CSAR Net General Aptitude in New Outlook. The new 6th edition of the book is available now in the market. You can buy it from Amazon or Flipkart. So, I'm launching a new video lecture series on the June 2019 CSAR Net Part A section questions, which many students ask me doubts on. So, this is one such question. The question reads like this. Of four agents, alpha, beta, gamma, and delta, three have to be sent together on a mission. If alpha and beta cannot go together, beta and gamma cannot go together, and gamma and delta cannot go together, then which of the following holds? Option A, any three agents can be sent. Option B, alpha, delta, and any one out of beta and gamma can be sent. Option C, beta and gamma, and any one out of alpha and delta can be sent. Option D, the mission is impossible. The question is a very simple question, but I think due to the length of the question, many people didn't actually understood the meaning of the question, or even if understood the meaning, they don't know how to start the question with. So these are the given conditions in the question. Alpha and beta cannot go together for this mission. Beta and gamma cannot go together for this mission, and gamma and delta cannot go together for this mission. So not here, there are only four people, alpha, beta, gamma, delta. Now the question is asking, is there any possibility for three people among these three, four people to go together in a mission? So here, as I told, many people don't know how to start this question. My best suggestion is, try to just fix one person and then try from his perspective. For example, I am just fixing alpha. For alpha, there are only two possibilities, either alpha in the mission or alpha not in the mission. So I'm just categorizing it, it as case one and case two. So let's now analyze case one, alpha in the mission. If alpha is in the mission, these are the three possibilities, na? alpha, beta, gamma, alpha, beta, delta, alpha, gamma, delta. But these three cases will it be possible according to the given conditions that we have to check now so these are the given condition alpha beta cannot go together beta gamma cannot go together gamma delta cannot go together yeah analyzing these three conditions it is very clear that then alpha cannot be part of the mission why Al the first case sorry first possibility alpha beta is not possible because as the question says so that means this is impossible similarly this is also impossible because alpha beta cannot go together and the third possibility is also impossible because gamma and delta cannot go together because of this condition so all the three possibilities when alpha was in the mission is impossible so alpha cannot be in the mission so now the only remaining the remaining cases alpha not in the mission if alpha is not in the mission means definitely the remaining three people should be in the mission beta gamma and delta should be in the mission but is it possible it is not possible because of this condition given in the question gamma and delta cannot go together so definitely the case alpha not in the mission is also not possible as both the cases are not possible, the answer is the mission is impossible. That is, option D is the correct answer. If you want to attend my online course for CSAR Net Part A section, which explains all these topics in detail, you can download the mobile application Christie's Classes from Google Play Store and join for the course. For any more information, you can WhatsApp to this number 8075-116641. These are the free online resources I provide from my classes. There is a website christyvergis.in, the YouTube channel you are watching Christie's classes and there is a WhatsApp discussion group. If you want to join for the WhatsApp discussion group, just text to this number given here. There is a Facebook page and there is an Android app as I told which you can download from Google Play Store. These are the courses I offer at my classes. 
there is an online course and offline course for CSA and general aptitude and there is a classroom coaching for gate general aptitude I mean educator at an academy also as you know an academy is a platform where you can get many online courses for many different competitive exams this is the course I'm running now in an academy crash course on general aptitude through previous year questions I will be launching a new course on general aptitude from the next month comprehensive course on CSA and general aptitude so if anyone is interested to join this co these courses you can join me at an academy through the mobile application or through the website anacademy.com if you are planning to join for any courses in an academy of mine or any other educators at an academy you can use this referral code CC10 to get special discount for your subscription so I hope this video was informative for you thank you all have a good day